And in Lawrence, there's a big plea right now for more trails. That's right, better access to the grocery store, shops and restaurants, just to name a few things. The city's working on it and hoping the money comes through for a big project that would mean a giant step forward. Driving around Lawrence, no problem. But in some places to the north, walking. <laughs> so, um, how can I put it? Is a different story. Not, Dr. Franklin uh, Reisner is president of Indies actual, Urban Wilderness, a group of volunteers advocating for trails throughout Marion County. Right now, he says the historic Fall Creek Greenway ends at a critical point in need. There are 50,000 homes. Um, and this area has an average walkability score of about 13. And to put that in context, we're talking about zero to 100. Communities are scored on walkability, meaning the higher the number, the more walkable an area is to get around. So we don't have walkability. We don't have access to uh, other neighborhoods, to commercial centers, to places of work. Uh, so this is huge. What's here, huge, he says, flag. would be a $5 million grant from the state to extend the Fall Creek Trail from Lee Road at 63rd Street to the Upper Loop Trail at Geist Crossing. Advocates say more trails are needed all over Indiana, and not just for convenience, but for our health. In a state that struggles with high obesity rates and cardiovascular disease, uh, Reasoner, a doctor, says better access to recreation to do, can uh, make a real difference. Segment. It's intuitive, but there's also a lot of science to show us that if you build it, they will come. You can improve people's physical activity by providing those opportunities. So the city of Lawrence and Indies Urban Wildlife have applied for a next level trail grant through the state. It's about a $5 million project. They're going to hear back on whether they got the grant coming up in December. And so how long is this Fall Creek Greenway? Well, right now it's about 18 and a half miles long. It goes from downtown Indy. It's a really nice trail. Wow. It goes up to Fort Harrison State Park. The goal is to eventually connect all the way up to Fishers. That's really cool. It's something that you don't really think about until it's not there. Yeah, sure. Until you need it. Yep. So here they are trying it's to a, change it. It's a fantastic network of trails. So okay. they really need it. All right, Dustin, thanks.